Okay, so this is the antenna. I'm gonna clean it now and well, just to take some dust. And I'm gonna be painting with the chromium paint in this space. But the windows are open, the door is open. Uh, it's good to have good ventilation. And it's very windy today, so I'll see if you can actually hear. I'm gonna show the... Well, the antenna is right here. And this is the chromium paint that I'm gonna use. Bright chromium paint. Just shake it. I, I have been shaking it for already couple minutes that should be fine okay, and that's the Let's see. It was not as reflective as I hoped. You can see my hand a little bit there. But yeah, I'm gonna be testing this one. I haven't measured the length. We have a bigger one right here. And the idea is to use that one too. That is the receptor for the antenna. Where all the the signals are concentrated so we are probably gonna repurpose that to hold a pot or something where we want to cook so that's the idea to use this for cooking all right I'm gonna take it outside you want to work Okay, I'm gonna take it outside. It's very windy, so I'm not sure if anyone can hear anything. Okay, yeah, it's a little bit bright. I think it's a good, maybe work. We'll see. And uh, it's upside down because I cannot hold it with one hand and record. But kind of, this is the idea. I mean, I'm already trying because I know that it's not heating up too much. Kind of like that. I can feel that it's warm. If I leave it a few seconds, that is starting to burn. So maybe it will work. Maybe. I hope. I'm gonna measure the, the size to have an idea compared to the big one. Alright, so I'm gonna be measuring the temperature using this thermometer. It's the only one I could find at this point. Here. All the numbers. But yeah, that's what I'm gonna be using. And also this piece of paper, just to check if it can actually burn. I don't think so, but I'll see. I'm just supporting it with this drawer and Okay, I'll try to find the point where the sun is. That's probably the best orientation. And we'll see. I have this thermometer and this piece of paper. I'm 
the sunlight. But that will also reduce its output. Let's see here. It is around 30 degrees Celsius. So just from those moments it reached a little bit over 40, about 42 is going down quickly, but yeah, around 42 with a few seconds and I was moving too much. So maybe it could be used, I'll see. Okay, now I'm gonna measure this small dish. on the short side okay so this one is the big dish so on the longer side is about 100 centimeters and on this side is about 91 centimeters I'm gonna try to make this one reflect as well so the idea with using paint for this one is, uh, well, I wanted to see how reflectant it could be with just paint and nothing more sophisticated. And it seems to reach good temperatures, but I'm gonna do a proper test uh, tomorrow if the weather is appropriate. Also, what I'm gonna later do is to cover uh, the surface, maybe on that one or this bigger one. Uh, with aluminum foil and uh, see how much it can improve the temperature But it will be probably just a temporary decision. I don't know. Let's see how we can protect the aluminum foil from breaking since it's so fragile All right Well, hope you enjoyed the video and like and subscribe if you want to see more of that that I probably make a video explaining how solar concentrators and solar ovens work to give more insight or background into that part. All right, thanks for watching and yeah, click the bell icon to get notified when I post a new video. I'll be putting this uh, solar related projects into a playlist so you can easily find them and watch them.